Like that? Was it supposed to be like that? Was it supposed to be like, like that? <laughs> turn it this way? guys this is Adana I am back with another video for you guys I first want to say thank you thank you thank you so much to all of you for subscribing and following me on this journey through PA school I really appreciate it I cannot believe that there's over 3,000 of you guys that are following me and like coming along with me on this journey so I'm really grateful for that so I just want to say a really quick thank you to you all but guess what you guys I am back in school I am in my third semester of didactic year oh my gosh you guys time flies I cannot believe that it's already been how many months seven months that I've been in PA school I'm in my third semester this is the last semester of didactic year before I start clinical so I'm really really excited about that but what I'm also excited about is the fact that we get to do a lot more like actual like physical examinations with the different simulations and the different like the mannequins and then also we get to do it on freaking standardized patients like that is so crazy to me like I'm actually gonna have like a real live human being like <laughs> sitting in front of me and I'm gonna be doing like a breast exam on her or like a pelvic exam or DRE which is a digital rectal exam so like this is crazy you guys I'm really excited about that and that is what I'm talking to you all about today in my physical diagnosis class that's when we learn how to actually like see the physical signs of the disease process that we're going to probably be trying to diagnose right so we're looking at the body we're doing like our tactile fremitus and our percussion to see like do we hear dullness or resonance and, and those different things. This past week, we actually learned how to do the female genital examination. So um, if you're a female over the age of 18, you've had your pap smear done and um, you know, you've gone to your OBGYN and they've perform this on you and if they haven't then you should go ahead and go get that checked that's what I learned how to do I learned how to do that you guys um, it was pretty crazy because we're sitting up here with like the forceps and I'm going in and I'm like checking things out and you know we have to know what normal feels like um, and we're gonna feel a lot of normal and so that when we feel an abnormal we know hey, like this is abnormal, this should not be here, you know? This ovary is like super, super firm and hard, so there's something going on, or I'm feeling the ovary period, like I shouldn't really be feeling this ovary at all. So things like that. And it was really, really exciting because I got to do that this week, and so that is what this video is gonna show for you guys. Was it supposed to be like that? Like, turn it this way? <laughs> Which means? Like, all the way, like, look at where I'm at. Oh, yeah. It kind of went that way a little bit. What do you think, Adana? You know, she has a growth on her cervix, and it seems like this right ovary is a little what is it? sclerotic. Scler <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what the professionals say. All right, so that was it. As you can see, I still could use like a little bit of work with um, my description of things. Um, I said sclerotic, but it was more like 
fibrous. Um, it was very, very hard and firm, and it was actually like a polycystic ovary. And she hasn't come back and told us exactly like what um, was wrong, if it was just cysts or if it was like cancerous, but we, you know, like the ovary was super huge um, and it was like super like, had a bunch of whole different little fibrous um, growths on it. So it was really cool, you know, to see the difference, feel the difference. Um, you can see I still need a little bit help with my palpation, but that's what this is all about. It's about learning, it's about getting better, it's about feeling what normal feels like and feeling what abnormal feels like. So when we don't know, um, we we're in class, we can ask, and um, it was really fun, and I, I love it. I cannot wait for the rest of the semester, um, and just, I think it's two weeks, yeah, and just like two weeks, we're gonna have our standardized patients coming in, um, so we're gonna get to do a lot of like exams on real patients, so I'm, I'm really excited, you guys, and I'm even more excited that I'm getting to learn and be more of this like actual clinician, like, you know, like for, kind of play clinician, but like soon to be real like PAC. But that was it, just a live look into my, my class and me and um, some of my cohorts as they recorded me um, doing that exam. If you like videos like this, please let me know. Leave it in the comment section below. If you wanna see more videos like this, just tell me, yeah, Donna, I would, I love this. And um, I'll try to get some more of those out for you guys. Pray for me, y'all, as I complete this last semester. And um, thank you guys so much for joining me on this journey. If you have not already done so, go ahead and subscribe right now to my channel and follow me on Instagram at Adana the PA. 